Hello everybody. Hi, welcome back. Guess what I'm making today? Ooh, I am making catfish pepper soup. Delicious. You know, this weather is getting a little cold, so you might be like, oh, I don't know what to have, I don't know what to eat. You might be watching your weight. Sis, bros, get catfish. Like, it's super easy to make. With this video, you will learn how to make it super easy and it's gonna come out delicious. So, let's get started. Okay, I have my catfish here, um, clean and cut. So, there is one trick. Um, when you try one trick of, of making your catfish, make sure you always pour hot water on it. If you cook it like this, it's going to break everywhere. Before you finish cooking, the whole the whole pepper soup will be full of fish. It will not be still like this. It will just break easily. So the trick you have to do is boil your hot water, pour it over it. It will it will kind of shrink it so it wouldn't break into pieces. So I have my hot water boiling, so I'm just going to transfer it to the fish. Ooh, it is super hot. I'm going to pour a little bit more. You see? So with this, you will see how this, this pepper soup will look. It won't break until I'm done cooking. It will still be intact. If you have not tried this method before, try it, and you're gonna say, "Wow!" Just making sure I have it all in the water. It's super hot, so you cannot eat the the fish shrink. So with this, you're good to go. So I'm just going to transfer it. I'm going to transfer the whole fish out because I'll be using this. To make this, I will be using all this. Nice, I'm going to blend this all together. This pepper is really spicy, very, very spicy. So we call it pepper soup. So you have to be really spicy for me. You can you can do um anyhow you like it, it doesn't have to be super spicy for you to eat it. But I, I like it to be spicy when I eat it. I have my spicy red pepper, three, and then I have my onions. So I'm gonna add ginger. I'm just gonna cut it a little bit to help my blender. this whole fish inside the pot. All set. 
going to pour in my blended pepper that <coughs> on this. Oh, my blend is really spicy. Ooh. I will be using this herbs. Uh, we call it Osha Kurisha. Here, here is optional, but I like to use it in my pepper soup. So I'll be adding it. I'll be adding water. You know, add water to the level of your fish. You know, you can make it a meal like I'll be doing. So I'll okay. Here I have my crayfish. I'll be using crayfish. I will be of making it a meal, which is optional. You can use plantain, yam, or potato. It's up to you. I have my um, pepper soup spice. This is my um, a set leaf, and this is my part of the herbs that I'll be using. But we call it ehu, which you can get in any African market. So all you have to do, I'm gonna add add it all right now. But I will not be adding the scent leaf. I will add the egg here and the pepper soup spice. I will give it a little stir. Okay, so I'm just gonna cover it to cook in about 10 minutes. I will come back and see how it's done so I can add my plantain. Been cooking. I'm gonna add my crayfish right now. Add some salt to taste, some no to taste. I'm gonna add my plantain. It's optional. You can you can add plantain. Or you can add yam. Or you cannot add. You can you can leave it like that. You can have it just like that. Cover it again for the plantain and the fish to cook a little bit. Then I'm gonna come back and add my scent leaf, and then we'll be done with this. So so far the plantain and the fish been cooking. So the last thing I'm going to add, I'm going to add my scent leaf. Daddy, that thing. I'm just gonna stir everything together. Remember, when you're stirring it, you have to be careful. You don't wanna break your fish. Still have the fish. All the baking sheets at the end break. So I'm just gonna take this tent out, and that is basically it. You have your catfish pepper soup. Delicious.
turn off the heat. And this, the pepper soup is ready. Isn't it super easy to make? And believe me, it tastes really good. Really good. Mm. And it's very spicy. Mm. But it's delicious. Thank you all for watching. And please, please, please subscribe to the channel. See you guys in my next video.